Talking about smiling faces, the man who scored two goals, David Condon, thank you very much for joining us. How does that feel? Uh, wonderful. Much better than the last two previous games, I think. We put in a good shift against Australia, but I think we let ourselves down against India, to be honest. And I know some of the lads were frustrated and we really wanted to come out and really play our game, put our game out there. We discussed that we wanted to make a lot more links between us as players, because I think we've been a bit disconnected. So I think we really worked hard out there to work on the little passes, and I think that made the difference yeah. today. First quarter, absolutely sensational. Came out of the blocks, admittedly they had a player down. Lost your way in the second quarter. Uh, what was said at half-time? Just go back to the simple things. So they came out and full pressed, and I think we struggled a bit with the offers, so we just said, look, lads, if they're going to full press us and we keep conceding the, the possession up the pitch, we're going to lose anyway, so just go out there, offer, pick it up and win a foul, and that's basically what we did. So Yeah, these guys have been... We, we knew how difficult it was going to be against Australia and worried about the intensity. Uh, you got off to a great start with the P, the P flick here from Ashley Jack Jackson. But were you much happier with the pace, the intensity that you were playing today? Yeah, definitely, absolutely. I think we spoke about the players being able to run through and offer those passes. I think we'd become a bit, a bit stationary on the ball in the previous game, so we really wanted to pick the ball up in motion, facing forwards, and then the offers can come, because then you can see the offers. Yeah, I'll looking. be pleased with this. Just talk us through this. So I'm in the middle, you can see me <laughs> just about there. <laughs> just one in the ball, so I just basically just... We've spoken about basically running toward the goal to fill in the space in between the last defender and the goalie. And we always talk about going to ground because that gives the best possibility to score the goal. So basically, I just slide in, hits my stick and goes in, basically. Yeah, make it I sound far easier than well, it actually is. Uh, <laughs> well, so we do every day at the training ground. So. I think it's the position of the pass and the timing of your dive is perfect. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, there's a great ball from David Ames that reversed it to find the channel between the defender and the goalie, so all credit to David Ames. Yeah, we thought you'd really take control of this game and then Korea made their way back in. It was like three days they were camped in the D. I, I was waiting to come on and it felt like that. It felt ridiculous. <laughs> Just corner after corner after corner. But credit to the boys in the goal, because they had to do... We had the same four defending all the corners throughout, so... Yeah. And this is when you suddenly lost your... You had to, Pina made a great save just before half-time. You had the half-time chat, and, of course, up came your second goal, right? Yeah, so... Well, is, I think this is it, isn't it? Yeah, here we come. Oh, no, it's no, Alistair, yeah. This is Alistair Broden's goal, so... This is not the prettiest goal we've ever seen. No, but they all count. <laughs> <laughs> We'd spoken about before the game that we wanted to try and get the ball going towards goal as early as possible. So I think if you saw in the first half, we had a lot of possession in the D, but we tried to actually swing and hit, and we were getting defended quite heavily. So we'd this, spoken about running in. This is your second. This is what we've spoken about a lot, about basically using the space away from the defender and the goalies. Granted, it was a bit of a big touch away from the goalie, which sent me from basically the P spot to the top <laughs> of the D. But <laughs> the space was there, luckily. And then just a shot, shot on target, basically. That gives you a bit of breathing space, that's yeah, what they call yeah, it technically. Yeah. It takes a lot of the pressure <laughs> off. So, don't yeah, be yeah, modest, yeah. don't be modest, but a great goal because he didn't even look up when he got that ball. He ran back towards the top of the circle, he didn't even look at the goal and he just fired it. Yeah. He knew your angles. So don't be modest, it's a great goal. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Uh, how much of a relief it is? You've got a big crowd in today. Uh, the pressure was on you uh, yeah, because yeah, you don't want to let them down, you're the hosts. Did you talk about that at all? Um, we like to put well. We put pressure on ourselves as a group. We weren't. We haven't been happy with the way we were performing. I mean, we worked hard against Australia, but I think against India, we kind of let ourselves down. And we knew that as a group. So we wanted to give the the kids something to shout about. But we wouldn't say the pressure was from outside. The pressure comes from within our group to perform every game. And that wasn't something we've spoken about. And we really wanted to prove a point. And I think we went out and did that. Well, as so. world number four, normally what you have to do is you set a certain bar and you raise the standard every game, especially yeah. when the Rio is coming so close. So I uh, did a great job done today. You raise the bar, you deliver it, well done, you got yeah. you get the fans Step one, <laughs> same again tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I mean, how? Do, I mean, everybody around here in this competition, apart from Korea, have got one eye on Rio. Uh, how has that been for you guys? Because you're not maybe 100% yet, are you 97% there? I think we just, basically, just week on week, we just try and improve step by step, as in Rio's the end goal, but we're basically just working as hard as we possibly can to be the best we can possibly be at Rio. So it's all steps towards that. And that each game here, the top teams in the world, it's all, all development for that. Well, thank you very much for joining us.